When we take a look at your calendar, you'll notice any activities that are scheduled on your programme, along with any sessions that you have with your trainer and any events you've booked into. All of these items are available for you to check out in more detail by simply clicking on them. Once you're inside some of the activities, like a booked event for example, you have some controls such as cancelling. If we go back to your calendar overview for a moment, you'll notice a drop down at the top of the page that reads other calendars. If your trainer has enabled their diary to be visible, you can toggle to see it here. It means you can see any of their availability and book into any events they may have. To check out any extra information that you need, you'll be able to see it on the event overview page. The majority of the important info is on the left hand side of the page, but if your trainer has any extra info, you'll find it in the description section. If there's a particular event you want to attend that requires credits to book in, then you'll have to top it up through the marketplace. This is where you can find any packages that your trainer has available that contain credits. If we look at the mobile app, the first thing you'll notice is how to navigate to the calendar section is very similar to that of the web browser. Just hit on the menu icon and select calendar. Once again, you'll be able to see all scheduled activities including book sessions and events. To check out either future historic activities, simply pull the date picker down from the top of the page and select the date you want to see. We circled the dates of activities book to help make it easier for you. You'll be able to click into the activities you want and either log what you've been up to or see the details of what's coming up. If you'd like to see your trainer's calendar, hit this icon and select the appropriate calendar. As with the web browser, you'll then be able to select the date and the event you're interested in. See what it's all about and if it's what you're looking for, book yourself in. One final thing when it comes to the calendar is that your hub, we've pulled out what activities need to be completed today so they have a quick overview from there. This goes for both the mobile app and the web browser.